Well, the Phoenix Suns are a little more than a half hour from tip-off. They'll play the second game of back-to-back -back home games. Tonight, they may finally see the big three on the court together. Cameron Cox is live at Footprint Center with a look at what to expect. And Cam, it's about time, right? <laughs> Crew Bay, well said. It's official. Say it. Mark it down. Frank Vogel confirming the news we've been telling you all afternoon. The big three going to make their debut tonight. One of them on the court right behind me. Check it out. Devin Booker getting his routine in, warm up before the game. It is official. Kevin Durant, Bradley Beal, and Book will play tonight for the first time all season. They're all going to be on the court. Finally, we get a true read on what this team can be. Of course, the Suns, they beat the Warriors last night, 119-116. Beal had 16 points in 27 minutes in his return. No, uh, he's not listed on the injury report tonight, so that's good news. Booker dropped 32 last night. Suns nearly gave it away in the final minute. Some awful decision to turnovers. Just a one-point game uh, late in the game, and they barely hold on for the win. Coach, kind of tired of that stuff. Four, if you count the last one, five layups, okay, with no resistance whatsoever. Okay, so we're not focused there. Press breaker was organized, but with two very careless plays and with two quick shots, you know, uh, in, in possessions. Got to stop doing that to ourselves. That being said, we enjoy wins. It's a good win. We lost uh, another guy out of our rotation, shorthanded. Shorthanded wins are great wins, and I was very proud of our guys competing and uh, doing enough to get the W. All right, speaking of wins, check this out. The Twins are back in town. Mikael Bridges and Cam Johnson played in the Valley for the first time since being traded to the Nets for Kevin Durant. Mikael and Cam, of course, beloved members of the Suns. Yes, they still feel the love from the Valley, both admitting being very emotional being back in this building. And it's weird that uh, Book is the only member left of that NBA Finals run team from a few years ago, but now they get to guard deep Book. I was excited because... Uh... I think the most I was guarding him was my rookie year and in practice. And um, he's definitely a different player from my rookie year now. So definitely going to be different and he's way better than he was. So I'm definitely excited for the challenge. I already, I already know his mindset. I already know what he's going to be on. So he knows me too. So it's going to be good. It's a cool feeling, man. I just I feel grateful to be in spots where I can leave and be so appreciative and and you know, it's, it's, it's really a blessing when you think about it to have people that you miss like this. Um, so I, I take it all as positives, man, and it doesn't feel weird coming back here. It's just, it's a cool feeling. You know, it's familiar. I've played here a lot of times and um, looking forward to playing here tonight. 